Susan Bryan's contribution to biological sciences started first as a faculty member, where her research in regeneration contributed substantially to the science of regeneration. And today, uh, it's not an overstatement to say that her contributions have led, ultimately, to UCI's major place uh, in the science of regenerative medicine. Sue is a, she's a, she's a scientist, she's an administrator, she's also a, a very strong family person, and her family extends well beyond her immediate family. It extends to all of her friends, and she's so incredibly supportive in everything that people around her are doing, uh, incredibly selfless. You know, the other thing about Sue is she's, that many people don't know is Sue's an artist. So in her spare time, and she doesn't have a lot of it, she, she paints, and, um, and if you go to her home, you'll see a lot of original art hanging on the walls. Um, she's, uh, she's incredibly diverse, has just incredibly talented. She has received awards for her teaching, excellence in teaching from UCI. She has won a prestigious medal for her research in limb regeneration. She's a leader in stem cell research and she's been an admired administrator and she also has been an ambassador to the world, really. She has given very popular lectures in this country and in Europe and in Japan, where she's raised the awareness of UCI and admiration for the university. Susan Bryant's influence as a UCI educator and as a pioneer in regenerative biology and regenerative medicine will continue to influence people's lives for generations to come. Besides being beautiful and brilliant, she is a wonderful friend. She is also funny. She has a great sense of humor. And another great talent of hers is that she's a great listener. If you have problems or troubles or just need advice, she will give it to you, and if you don't want it, she won't. She just listens. Susan Bryan is the person that everyone always wants in the room when important decisions are being made. Everyone seeks her counsel because she is so balanced, so fair, so committed to the institution that time and time again, her advice is the advice that everyone seeks. Whether we're talking about the allocation of resources around the campus, or how the university can move forward on diversity, or what the best influence is for the central administration in promoting teaching and research, Susan Bryan is the person we all turn to for the best counsel and advice. Her friendly demeanor, her balance, her sense of humor, all instrumental in determining the fact that Susan Bryant has had as much influence on this campus as any other person in shaping its character into the university that it is today. Mm -hmm.